Our tail of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. All right, early round action here featuring the first Kazakh fighter to sign a contract with the UFC, Uzbekistan Shavkat Rachmanov. He's one of the best finishers in the sport. Knockout submissions, he's got them in spades. As far as this matchup was concerned, he said he's gonna take what the opposition gives him. He's never in a huge rush, but more often than not, when you fight Rachmanov, you end up with Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. As his opponent postures up, he opens it. You need to fight that. Control now, DC. You know he's in his element on the ground. A lot of tricks up his sleeve. A lot of tricks. Well, he's in a compromising spot here, DC. You got to figure out a way to get back to your feet. Oh, he postures up in a big head strike by Rock Mama. Another ground and pound strike lands. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Wow. The hip toss as he takes him down. Now we'll see what he can do. Right into side control. Excellent ground and pound here by Rachmanov. All right, well, he's got him softened up here. Side control now. We'll see if he can advance position. Nice transition. Oh, good ground and pound here. Both fighters back to their feet now. What a beautiful leg kick that landed there. That one connected. He needs to do that when he's leading the day. Nice combination lands to the head. All right, well, good news is he rocked him. Bad news is he wasn't able to finish the job, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, you don't get those opportunities very often. You got to take full advantage of them when they're presented to you. He's got that single collar tie locked in. Oh, good defense here to stay upright after that single leg takedown offering. And they separate after exiting the clinch. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Lands that beautiful jab. Two minutes remain in the round. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Well, he has really put his opponent on the defensive here, really very aggressive right out of the shoot. He has landed a high number of total strikes, exactly the aggression you'd like to see, given what is at stake here tonight. nose there he is bleeding 45 seconds to go here in round one well no denying the durability on the other side but at this point you just got to find that kill shot and get him out of there a lot of times that comes with reps that comes with taking your time. You get excited and you want to finish because you think it's right there, but at times you just want to swing and you miss a lot. He needs to slow down if he wants to get his own out of his life. Rachmanov's cheek looks like it's caught. Yes, it is starting to bleed a little bit now. Trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. What a round. 
All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, so there's the end of the round, and on one side, thrill on the other, agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hands, the speed, how sharp he is, how technical he is. It allows him to land in spots where his opponent is winging punches. Great strike landed, great punch landed to put his opponent down. You ready to fight? Ready. Round two is on the way. Nice job defensively. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Useful strike there. The hook is clean. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that a lot Oh, he landed a flying knee to the head. Vision could become an issue in that left eye starting to close. Back to the jab now, no good. Hook shot attempt to the head here. Instead, it's blocked by Rachmanov. Well, this is absolutely the hurt business. It's hard to see which party is more injured, but I think both fighters have been really effective with their strikes. In this yeah, both guys have been affected. Both guys have been beat up. It's a very competitive fight. Let's see who has the heart to carry them through these very tough moments. Immediately gets the underhook. All right, they separate. Now we'll see who can get off in space. Rachmanov. Oh! Oh, God. So Rachmanov's in the stack guard now. Could be trouble here. Looks as though he will let his opponent stand back up. Yes. Three minutes now to go in this one. Jab, no good. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Wow, strong roundhouse kick there. You can catch a body kick, but you gotta step off the side. You just can't take it clean. All right, well, that blow is busting from that cut with each strike landed, and he continues to effectively target that area. You know, we are talking about a guy with super high fight IQ. So when you give him that blood, that crimson ray is nothing more than something that inspires him to continue doing what he's doing. So you have got to change something. You got to get your head moving so you're not taking too much damage to that cup. Oh, big elbow. Less than two minutes now to go in round two. Looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault, and really has been all night long as he continues. Oh! Oh! We set it inside the octagon for the official decision. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 15 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Chuck Hall.